will leave the track next time round. the lead as they go into turn one two round the outside goes Mick Turner round the outside goes Cole uh, O'Toole O'Toole goes up into second place he's got a good run through the first lap all one car getting into a little bit of trouble with the 46 of John Leonard Mick Turner goes right round the outside he goes up into third place John Arnott's gone through with him he's gone up into fourth place and Steve Edwards Colin O'Toole, Mick Turner, John Arnott. They're running one, two, three, and four. They're not just quite getting the drive at the moment. I'd say another couple of laps and they'll start to pull the drive out of the track. Colin O'Toole getting up very high in turn two, followed by Mick Turner. Then comes the 62 car of John Arnott, followed by Clint Cosgrove. Steve Edwards still the leader from Colin O'Toole. Mick Turner going up on the inside of O'Toole. He grabbed second spot. Arnott still running fourth. Cosgrove is fifth. Still Steve Edwards showing the way, but Mick Turner, he's the real danger. He's only about 25 or 30 metres behind Edwards and getting very much closer to him as they come out of turn two. Steve Edwards will have, oh, he's up very high. Turner went up with him, but Edwards uh, selling out right in front of the pack. Somehow the other two cars got by him. He just got a little bit too panicky, did Steve Edwards, going out of turn four and threw his chances away. 61, Mick Turner has the lead. Round the outside of the slower cars. Colin O'Toole in second place, about 35 or 40 metres behind. Steve Edwards, also about 40 or 50 metres behind Colin O'Toole. He's in third place. Clint Cosgrove has got up to fourth spot and John Arnott is running fifth. Well, they're really strung out. The leader, Mick Turner, driving very well tonight. He certainly had a big night. He has only seven laps to go in the French Brothers Tyres modified rod feature. Colin O'Toole is running second. Steve Edwards is third. Clint Cosgrove is fourth. Rod Fraser's now got up to fifth. And John Arnott's dropped back to sixth. But Mick Turner in car 61 leading quite clearly. Colin O'Toole in second place, Steve Edwards running third, Clint Cosgrove is fourth, Rod Fraser is fifth, John Arnott is sixth. Perhaps the most interesting battle is in those cars running fourth, fifth and sixth. But Mick Turner, the race leader, is actually catching up to them and he could quite in fact lap them. So Turner's going to go uh, up to this group of cars battling it out for the minor placings. Oh, there's John Arnott getting a terrific split coming down main straightaway to go up into fourth place. Clint Cosgrove on the outside is fifth. On the inside, Rod Fraser, who's sixth. Here's Mick Turner coming at them on the outside. Lapping flag is out. Clint Cosgrove losing the steering coming out of turn four. And Mick Turner is only going to have uh, Colin O'Toole and Steve Edwards on the same lap as him. Very impressive performance by Turner. There's only two cars on the same lap. That's Colin O'Toole and Steve Edwards. And Colin O'Toole staying to lap them too. So Mick Turner comes down, takes the chequered flag and a very impressive drive. A good win. 18, Colin O'Toole will be second. 14, Steve Edwards will be third. Now fourth place will go to the uh, 62 of John Arnott. 
fifth place to the 13 of Rod Fraser and sixth place to the 69 of Clint Cosgrove. And we actually completed the 15 laps in an uninterrupted time. The time for 15 laps, 4 minutes, 17.896 seconds.